What we've been doing with spider radio is basically it's a cognitive radio. It can scan the spectrum and it can find the best channels to use. And so there has to be a lot of intelligence built into the node. So the node has to first find out where are these empty spectrum that's being unused or underused and how do I capture this spectrum and if someone else starts using the same spectrum right it's going to be a lot of interference a lot of collisions so it has to scan for other spectrum uh, opportunities and then you know move your device to some other spectrum bands and so on and so forth. so it's a it's a dynamic process it's a dynamic optimization intelligent intelligence that's being built into devices that currently don't exist in you know state-of-the-art technologies So here is our test bed. This one is a transmitter and this one is a receiver. The laptop in the middle will just transmit some interference. And interference shows in the original channel. And what will happen to our test bed? We will just move to another channel automatically. So we started now looking at okay, what are the fundamental research issues and also what are some of the applications and how do we actually implement and develop a prototype that can be marketed. Many companies are working on this and also a lot of universities are working on this. Whoever comes up with a better product and whoever comes to the market first may be the winner.